This may look like a typical scoop of ice cream, but these flavors include an extra special ingredient, fly larvae. The larvae is farmed by a South Africa animal feed company. But according to Gourmet Grub, a Cape Town company that makes the ice cream, the protein-rich maggots are good for humans, too. Here, cocoa, honey, and the larvae are mixed together in an ice cream making machine. Insects are typically environmentally friendly and sustainable to farm because they use very little land, water, and food to grow on. They aren't at risk of climate change because you can grow them in a controlled environment. At this market in Cape Town, a couple of adventurous people decided to try out the sweet treat. It tastes organic, um, basically like how you'd expect like a vegan ice cream maybe to taste. So um, it's nothing too unusual for sure. Something that I can expect people eating quite comfortably. It tastes pretty good. It tastes like uh, ice cream should taste. Um, a little bit more earthy, a bit more organic taste. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty happy. This insect ecologist agrees fly larvae is nutritious, but he's not sure he would eat the ice cream. The problem is one of culture, convincing people that this is something that they should be able to eat. I'm not sure that I would be interested in a, an ice cream or dairy product made of fly larvae, simply because there are a number of delicious um, plant-based alternatives available and uh, culturally they're much easier to stomach. But Gourmet Grub thinks products like this larvae ice cream are helping to make insect food more acceptable worldwide. I think insects and a lot of people have a mental barrier associated with that, uh, but the ice cream has played a significant role in helping especially the Western consumers overcome that mental barrier. To all things insects and food, Deborah Block, VOA News.